Maya, Charlie, I believe you know Mr. Masseria. Everybody sure. Joe the boss. Then <clears throat> perhaps you also know, though it is of course news to me, that a card game you operate is located in territory that Mr. Masseria considers to be his. No considers. He's mine. My thinking was, before any more blood is shed, that a compromise can be reached. More blood? Tompkins Square Park. My two nephews. I don't know what you're talking about. Apparently, two of Mr. Masseria's emissaries to your establishment were murdered shortly after their visit. We do operate a game in what might be termed a gray area territorially, but as to any violence in the neighborhood... Ah, they stubbed themselves, huh? It's a coincidence that it happens. On my streets. No coincidence. But this little prick, since he's 10 years old, he causes problems. Well, it seems to me you boys ought to extend a token of goodwill towards Mr. Messeria. Shall we say a one-time fee of $2,000 for the families of those gentlemen and a tax of 10% on the game going forward? Hold on a fucking second. Charlie. No. 10% is okay. For now. Then we have an agreement. Ma che minchia fa costi a mazzo Cristo? Ecco mia, pazzo ricco. Con l'altro mano si entra una sacchetta. Picciotto. Non c'è scassà, minchia. Io ti taglio, passo. Ti passo. Ciao. Ehi, hey, oh. Two grains bad enough. But 10% of the fucking game. We already pay half the take on that game to you. Yes. And now you boys know why. Better yet. Give me 10 rum, then 20 each of the Ryan whiskey. Hey! Peddle your goods elsewhere. I'll not be needing your services. Fuck you talking we work about for Mr. Thompson. These are not Mr. Thompson's men. You want this order or not? He does not. I take you for a soldier, lad. I was. Huh? And who is it you're fighting for now? Right. Back in the truck now. Like it, lads. I don't take orders from no fucking patty. Of course you don't. This is America. <laughs> Why'd you not shoot me? Not me yet. I got no quarrel with you, sir. We're just not buying any liquor. 